What's up, gamers? It's your boy, Launchpad1412. Excited to be back with another video, man. Another. Shout out to GS. <laughs> uh, video right here, man. And it feels good to be back. It feels good to be back. Um, I'm not necessarily going to talk about anything specific, but let me know in the comment section. Or sometimes you guys hit me on the message board on Twitter or Instagram. If y'all going to talk about something specific, just let me know. Uh, I would love to talk about whatever you guys want me to talk about. But we're going to commentate this one, man. We got the Pittsburgh Steelers. My opponent has the Houston Texans. I think it's a nice bat down right there on the third and 18. Forced me to punt on the first draw. I, I did like, did not like how my passing game felt on that drive. It, it really bothered me. I'm like, hopefully when I get the ball back, I'll be able to make something happen passing-wise. But let's see what happens. I send the blitz right here, and he gets a nice nice catch. Well, Lamar Miller. Lamar Miller catching passes right here, man. Having a pretty solid, great sound game on the ground. We got a decent game, man. This game's not bad. Decent game. Um, probably... You know, one of, I, I would say one of the best games I've had is like at the interception. It's your boy. I would say, let's say uh, one of the best games that I, I've ever had. But definitely, um, you know, a game that, um, you know, a game that's really entertaining to watch. That's what I was kind of referring to. One of the more entertaining games to watch. We got big plays all over the place. My opponent getting big plays. I'm getting big plays. It's just, uh, this is one of those games that gets a wide open play right here. A huge play. People are wide open. And, oh, my defense. I'm like, man, what the heck is going on, man? He continues to drive, and Lamar Miller get a nice little run play right there. Third down and three. I think he wanted to go to the left, but when did he change his mind and went back to the right one to the left again? But it's your boy looking good, Billy Ray. And we end up getting that interception pick. Another pick six, man. That was them using pick six are paramount, man. They are life, man. You just it, there's just nothing better to do in Madden than that, man. So we're up fourteen nothing. You know, on the board, I have I haven't had to score with my offense. This is a lovely, comfortable lead right here, but I can't get too comfortable because I have been up 21 and, and have lost a game before. Yes, you guys saw that game. I think it was last year when I was up 21 and the guy came back with me. I couldn't believe it. Then we forced the fumble right here. And you're probably looking at this like, yeah, LP, like he got this one in the bag. Watch how this guy plays, though. Now, he's down 14 and nothing. He's still aggressive. At this juncture of the game, I don't feel like he's out of it. You get a nice pass right there to Antonio Brown. Antonio Brown had a couple real nice catches in this game where, like, he, where Roethlisberger threw the needle, and he probably could have got hit so hard that he probably would have lost, like, one of his <laughs> chest plates, but he ended up holding on to the ball anyway. I mean, thankfully, I was throwing to Antonio Brown. We got a nice uh, screenplay right there, even though Le'Veon Bell fumbles out of bounds. But, uh, you know, being though it was Antonio Brown, because if any other receiver, we probably wouldn't have got you know, that, that nice play. But look at this, man. Your boy right here getting the touchdown right there. And I'll take that 21-point lead. It feels good to get a touchdown like that because I don't normally get touchdowns that way where I hit somebody with a juke. I don't use the juke a lot. I'm usually more of a stiff arm guy. You know, that juke, it's, it's not necessarily overpowerable, man, but it just seems like you can have Fred Flintstone in this game and they'll juke like D'Angelo Hall. Oh, it's just kind of weird, man. My opponent's touchdown right here in three plays on that drive. And this is what I'm talking about. This guy plays like he's never out of the game. So when you're playing like this, you always have a shot to win. 21-7 that quick before the half ends. I get lucky right there as <laughs> my tight end catches that pass. Right there. I don't know who that tight end is, number 81. I'm not really sure why I'm not familiar with the Steelers tight end. I'm not sure why. But that tight end got some hands, man. He catches almost anything it feels like. So I try to bust out a run right here, but J.J. Watt ended up tackling me right there. Like, you got to be kidding me. Forcing me to punt. But we're up 21-7, so we're feeling good. And right here, just a couple plays I'm going to show you before the half ends. You know, a couple of nice plays, like, well, well, just, well, just one play right here. He gets a nice run right here. But thankfully, he doesn't take it all the way for the touchdown. Thank goodness. But that's, it was a nice run. I, I didn't feel like uh, I, I didn't feel like it would be fair not to show you like that. <laughs> it was a nice little run. But anyway, we, you know, kicking the ball off now. We're up 14. You know, we're up 14, which is it which doesn't feel like a lot right now. Because he gets a score right here. He's only down seven. He gets a stop and scores again. You know, it's a tied ball game. So sometimes when you see 21 to 7, you know, 21 is two digits versus 7 being one digit. It really looks like a blob, but it's really, really not. And my opponent is acting like like he's not even like not even down. He's throwing all kinds of crazy passes all over the place. And my defense is not, I don't have like one of the best defenses in the league. You know what I mean? Especially when I play with a team that's not necessarily like, I get a nice sack right there. But let's be honest, the Pittsburgh Steelers are not necessarily known for their pass defense, so... You know, as he almost catches that right there. You know, so you got to think about that, factoring in that my defense is not necessarily great. It's not. It's not suspect, but it's like. But it's. It's like. I think my defense is kind of like a B minus. You know, versus an A. I mean, a plus to, to F. My my my. My defense is like a B minus C plus at times. You know, depends on what day. 
Well, every now and then I'll have an A-plus defense, you know what I mean? But it's very, very rare. I know you're probably thinking, like, what, what in the world are you talking about oh, AP? I mean, LP, he just uh, <laughs> got two interceptions for a pick six. But, I mean, you know, at the same breath, you have to counter in that this year is different because of the team. It's not like uh, it's not like last year or other years where if you played good defense, it, it really mattered to a degree. But the attributes of the other defenders, you know, on my squad, like the touchdown right there, making it 20 to 10. The attributes of the other defenders on my squad really are, are really, really paramount in defense because there are some safeties that won't react, and there are some uh, <laughs> there are some cornerbacks that won't bat the ball down. So I have to consider that, you know, when I play this game, and that, and that we all have to consider that. And that's why sometimes I'm thinking in my head, like, like man, somebody can score on me almost any time. There's no, I, I never feel too comfortable to where someone can't, you know, come back on me. And I know some people are like, yo, that's a, that's actually a really good way of thinking. But if you think about, you know, games in the past, I get the interception right here. My opponent's going to quit on this right here. But if you think real quick, you think about games in the past, you know, I could play sound defense. And I'd be confident, like, uh, there's a, I'd be confident in my mind. I'd be thinking to myself, there's a 90% chance that my opponent is not going to score right here. But now it's like 50-60. You're booing.